Hello Internet, Martin here. Day 20 of my Vlog365 challenge. This is the several takes that I've done today. Um, I started recording this a couple of hours ago and then got interrupted by a phone call. Oh, and it keeps going out of focus and ah, it's all I'm going to say. Because I'm trying to do these without any edits and cuts. Um, because it just, I think it's a bit, bit too complicated at that point. So, uh, today's Monday. Um, not been feeling too good today. I've been in bed ill, I think. You know, just tired and just like dozing off but we will get there um but i've been working on the community radio awards um and in fact when i got interrupted doing one of these for a phone call was with don chambers to talk about the community radio awards and the wider sector uh hopefully he's interviewing me for his radio show in radio uh for this week um so hopefully he's interviewing me he's supposed to be doing it today but it didn't quite happen um but the community radio Awards, something i've been passionate about i've been talking about for years and years been working on it sort of 18 months two years the idea being that uh, it's an award to showcase celebrate and promote the fantastic work that community radio does in its community or for its community and all the thousands hundreds and thousands of volunteers that are involved volunteers and staff that are involved in doing that radio um because other sectors have theirs, so there's the student radio, the hospital radio, commercial radio, and BBC all have their own sector awards. Um, but then also there is sort of there's the New Yorkers and or it's called the New Yorkers. There's the New York Radio Awards and the um, uh, the Radio Academy Awards, which which work the Sony's and then were the Radio Academy, and now there's something different. But the issue is with some of those other bigger awards is about inclusivity and accessibility in the sense that I think the Radio Academy ones that they're doing at the moment, I think the nominations have just closed or the submission windows just closed for them. But I think it was like over £100 for an entry, which is a big thing for community radio. I mean, ours was £5 an entry for comparison, really. Um, uh, our ceremony is on the 10th of September and I'm really looking forward to that. Um, we've I've gone from the approach if I wanted a sort of a laid back, chilled quite type ceremony, don't want anything too formal, especially as the it's the evening of the community media conference, which is run by the CMA in the same place, so, um, uh, the uh, Birmingham City University. Great venue. Went up and visited there a couple of months ago. Um, looks really really good. Uh, so we're looking for a laid back, chilled environment to um, announce who the uh, bronze, silver, and gold. Um, for each category is we're not I'm not I'm trying not to use the word winners because I have this fluffy approach that I think everyone's a winner in community radio including the audience they're the big winners because of that um, that uh, extra choice and all the community development and community benefit social gain that community radio does uh, so it's you know gold silver bronze and hopefully we're looking at putting short lists of um, five or so uh, per category 16 categories it's been a long old slog i certainly have learned a lot i'm really looking forward to the long term of the community radio awards and how they develop um in the future uh hopefully people will be really will see it for what it is which is the first year so we're making a start um which will be really really cool um and we've had um over 300 no, was it 300? 200? 235 entries even, um, 40 odd stations, which is over 20% of the sector, which, uh, all those that could apply, which is absolutely great. Um, if, you, if you're interested in the awards, head to communityradioawards.co.uk, not to be confused with .com, I think they own some of the other domains. There was another, or is another set of awards, they were supposed to be happening I think this week, but they didn't happen um, um, because of some medical reasons, they're sort of their chief exec type person Leroy um, and I've wished him wished him well wish him the best um, it's a shame because it was another opportunity to celebrate and promote community radio um, but head to my awards community radio uh, awards.co.uk um, coming up to the four minute mark so I'm not going to talk for much longer uh, because I'm going to say are you interested in the community radio awards let me know what you're looking forward to or, or if you've got any questions about it please post them in, uh, in the comments section on Facebook uh, on, on YouTube even down below uh, like subscribe to my channel and share and I'll see you guys tomorrow